Hi folks and welcome back to Salford York Street for um, a very brief update on the progress made. Um, there, isn't much, there hasn't been an awful lot done. I know I promised I'd get a bit done over this month but it's been hot and there have been unforeseen circumstances um, that have led to my inability to do an awful lot. Having said that, I've made a little bit of progress here and there. So um, I'll just quickly walk you through that. Then after this uh, couple of minute update, I'll just leave you with a few shots of some trains running. And I apologise greatly if you can hear an aeroplane going over now. That is just typical timing, I haven't heard one all day. Um, battling on though. You can see here, along the side of the uh, road, I've started, uh, well I've carried on laying the security fencing. Um, it seems to defy the laws of physics that I can just put some glue on the bottom and it stands up, but it's worked so I'm not going to complain. Um, oh, blimey, the whole street seems to be out in force to make as much noise as it possibly can right now. Um, the security fencing is in place then, well partially, we've got nine pieces down now, but I've got plenty more uh, on waiting. So as I've said, it's going to follow the pavement all the way down to the warehouse there behind those yellow vans, the British Rail vans. And it's also going to come along in front of the cobbles. So all the way along, sorry, all the way along here and down past the goods yard. Um, oh, and another aeroplane. We're, we're doing well, aren't we? The goods yard itself, there hasn't been an awful lot of progress on. Um, as you can see, because I've not had a chance to get down to the model shop and buy some track. But uh, that'll hopefully follow soon. Should be done by the end of the month, I, uh, I would hope. Um, but then over here, I'll be very surprised if you can see anything right now. So I'll keep it brief. But over there, uh, the town scene has had some progress made up with it. Because we've got the uh, base layer of asphalt down. If you're wondering what you're supposed to be looking at, uh, I'll come back over here and show you. So it's just this stuff here has been laid on the most part. Um, you probably saw look at that house. There's been some sort of earthquake. You probably saw all sorts of buildings and road vehicles over there. That's just holding the last couple of pieces down. Now they've been glued. Uh, and the only other thing I've done as well as adding some of these cobbles here and the doctors moved in. Um, other than that is just add some foliage here because I tried to tone these cobbles down the middle down so they looked a bit more realistic and a bit more worn but it failed on the most part so I've just tried to cover it up with some of this foliage and again the little soil triangle there uh, I've just covered with some bushes. Um, I'm probably going to use that sort of bushy stuff along the back there behind that pavement as well or something similar to that anyway um, or I might have some low relief buildings we'll have to see I think but yeah I've left some of the foliage down so that's pretty much all I've got up to this month um, so I will leave you now uh, until next month with some shots of the trains running uh, on the track which will hopefully be ballasted within the next few months uh, an ambitious plan I know because it's me but you never know and uh, I hope you can enjoy the trains running on the track as it is at the moment I'll try and get it in some scenic places so it looks at least a little bit realistic for you right ta-da for now